Bye bye. Winning cultures start with a head coach. A lot of coaches in college ball, there's a lot of smoke and mirrors. They're not direct with you. He's a genuine dude. Northern Kentucky's head coach, Dizzy Payton's philosophy is simple. We really do it for the wins and losses. It's to hopefully help these dudes, you know, grow into better young men as we as we go through this journey together. Despite the sentiment, the Norse are winning a lot this year, sitting at first place in the Horizon League. Yeah. When Peyton was promoted to NKU's head coach two years ago, he made a decision. Well, after I'd got done crying, uh, just because I was so honored to 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 be in this position, um, I knew that I wanted to get Ryan on the website and and give him promotion. The assistant to the head coach, that's a sp special thing that, that, that I like. Over the phone, he's like, man, you're making me emotional. Ryan Mavripolis, AKA Mav, earned the promotion, grinding his way up for about a decade. It all started when Mav met then assistant coach Diz. Mav called his shot. He said, hey coach, I wanna be your head team manager. He said, yes. A decision that changed both of these men forever. For years, Mav and Dizzy were roommates on road trips. Just another dude and uh, just another really important person in my life that happens to have, you know, Down syndrome. A, a good friend of me. So I chose him to be in my way. Just friends being friends. Three years later, Dizzy asked Ryan to be in his wedding. I just knew I wanted him in there because uh, he's a special friend of mine. Two friends side by side doing what they love. Because baseball is my, is my passion. I love every sport of it. Yeah! There we go! That passion is what makes Mav an asset to the North staff. I gotta walk, gotta walk here. One of the teams I've ever been a part of has had a Mav. One of his other big responsibilities is keeping everybody in line and, and bringing the juice every day. Do it, boy! A lot of energy. I have to be juiced all the time. One of the things we always talk about is having a good vibe, staying loose, and like that's how we play our best ball is not putting too much pressure on ourselves. And he really does a great job of alleviating the pressure. Yeah. Have a day, brother. Let's have a day. Have a day. Have a day. You can go talk to all 38 guys on this team. They're all going to tell you the same thing. They love him. What's up, Matt? <sighs> to say that it uh, fills my heart up with joy uh, would be an understatement. Loving by example. This is my guy. Show people more love, you know? That's the best thing you can give to people. So. You give love, you'll get love. Building self-confidence. Being myself and good, good looking. Be good looking? Yeah. You're killing that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Making a difference. Helps me be better. And uh, hopefully I'm helping them, uh, them be better. Why does that hit such a chord with you? Because <clears throat> it's the whole reason I do this and uh, I don't know. It means a whole lot. The ultimate winning culture. Reporting, Marshall Kramsky, WCPO 9 Sports.